I woke up this morning with absolutely no idea what, what I was going to do today. At, at all. I, right now, I have a massive headache, so I apologize if I'm not, like, projecting as I usually do. And, I mean, even then, some people get annoyed at how I project, so. Anyway, I apologize if I, you know, I'm not screaming or, or swinging my head around like a fucking idiot like I usually do. It's because I've had this, like, looming headache ever since I went to sleep. And I guess it just lasted through the entire time that I slept. Given I slept, like, maybe six, seven hours, something like that. The average amount of time, I didn't sleep too long. But it was this headache that started, like, in my frontal lobe because this game... Last night... Like, sometimes this game, man, this game doesn't piss me off any more than any other Call of Duty would, so don't worry. But it's just... I... Okay, my head, man. Last night was a very bad time, okay? Like, for some reason, now, since everybody's being really competitive over this game, especially the people that originally played Call of Duty 4 that, I guess, like, think that they were the shit at it or, you know, were the shit and made, like, a big awesome montage and all this shit years ago. I've seen this increase of players that are tweeting at me uh, every single time I get into lobbies, saying shit like, oh, yo, uh, you're about to get fucking smacked in this lobby, kid. Go back to making your cut com. And then, you know, they can end up going double negative in the game. They don't say anything after that. But they come up with some sort of dumbass excuse as as to why they got destroyed or did bad that game or something. It was this dude I have, I don't know his name. I mean, nobody does, but. <laughs> this guy was tweeting at me. He's like, you ready to get slapped, kid? And I'm just like, I, I didn't say anything, obviously, because I was just looking at the tweets. Play the game through, dude ends up going like 25 and 52 or some bullshit. Dude goes double negative. I just enjoy liking those tweets after the fact because it's just, it's great. It's funny. It's just Call of Duty. Calm down. They take it like super personal whenever I, I don't know, join the lobby and like kill him or something. It's weird. I don't... It's so weird. But that wasn't the main thing that stressed me out last night. It was just, I, okay, there are days on Call of Duty where you just, it just, it's not a good day. People are all playing like, it seems like the world is against you. Nothing's going right. You got people that you're hit marking point blank because they're still running Juggernaut. I still see, oh boy, oh fuck. It's one thing to run Juggernaut on your M16 class, even though clearly stopping power is better. You still should probably run stopping power over it, but I still see these snipers doing Juggernaut sniping and it's just, it's so fucking dumb. Play how you want, I, I don't care. Whatever, I'm done, I, I, whatever. I mean, clearly I care. It's pissing me off. But look, I mean, I don't care as in, you know what? Do what the fuck you want. Fine. Enjoy getting 80 hit markers a game. That's fine. Have everybody sending you mean messages and calling you a scumbag for playing like that. Fine. Go ahead. Your choice. Fuck it. But sometimes it just seems like no matter what lobby. Okay. It's one thing to get into a bad lobby, right? You get into a bad lobby and you're just kind of like, yeah, whatever. I'll leave this lobby. End up joining another one or I'll play this game out until it's over just so I get the match bonus or whatever. Win or lose. So you leave that lobby after it was bad. You're like, all right, that was a bad lobby. And then you join another game. And then it's a bad lobby again. And then you leave that game. And then you join another one. And it's a bad lobby again. And you try a different game mode. It happens to you again. And then you start getting down on yourself you're like there's no way it's this many bad lobbies in a row it's just i'm fucking garbage then you get down on yourself you don't want to play anymore or you're the type of person that after they get down on themselves they say hey fuck this i'm gonna get better so then you play even more and then after you play some more then you die some more and then you realize fuck it doesn't matter how much i play i'm always gonna be garbage i've been playing the game for 12 hours straight hit one fucking quad feed and that's it so that was mainly me last night but then it happened and now i can't show this one okay i've already shown a quad headshot feed uh, a clip that i hit you know a couple days ago and that was during a live comp but last night I was playing and well I I hit again um, I can't show you guys a clip uh, right now because it might just be the closer for the uh, MWR Team Taj coming out on phase soon. And I don't know if I've ever had a, a closer for a Team Taj on phase. I've had song openers and things like that and like cool little build up spots and stuff or right at the beginning of like song openers. But I don't think I've ever actually had a closer in the phase Team Taj yet. So this could be unless somebody else ends up hitting something. Might be, might not be. As far as I know, I'm the front runner at the moment. I want to say that I have a hard time believing anybody's going to hit something better than that in the time span. But again, I'm in a team with Blue and Sprout and all these other fucking freaks, kitty. I, uh... So I have a little secret clip here. Do I think it's the best clip ever hit on MWR? Eh... Nah, probably not. Is it my best clip? Yeah, for sure. Yeah, 100%. It's definitely my best clip. So that was one thing that made my night pretty easy. So I, I end up hitting that clip in the middle of the night after being pissed off. After I hit it, I was pretty happy for a while. And then the, the, the game started coming back again where it was just really bad, really bad, really bad. Playing this game is like an emotional roller coaster for me. I, oh, what a choice. We can play kill confirmed on bog or kill confirmed on bog. Let's just go random. If we get kill confirmed on Bog anyway. I actually have a few MW2 clips that I didn't even get to put in anything. They're just here. I don't know what the fuck to do with any of these. It's MW2. I mean, everybody's probably sick and tired of seeing that game. I don't make mini touches anymore. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing anymore. Okay, kill confirmed on Crash. I was gonna say. I was telling myself, like, fuck, I need some more M40 clips. And then that, that clip happened. I was just, ooh, ooh, you don't understand. I remember hitting a lot of people. It's just, yeah. Okay, well, all right. Fuck me. They're gonna put me back in the same game. It, it's weird. It kicks me out and then I can just join the game back. I get kill confirmed on Bog anyway. <laughs> what?
What the fuck are these spawns? Why am I here? Why was I born? Yo, is anybody gonna pick up the tag? Go fuck yourselves. You're all- Seriously, they both walked past it looking at it. I, you know what? I'm tired of getting shot by fucking air. I am tired. I'm getting triggered again. I, I, this headache just, I need to get this headache out of here. So of course, they, they all, they always have juggernaut. It doesn't matter, man. It doesn't fucking matter. Uh, he's sniping with juggernaut. I'm just gonna go take some medicine and eat my weight in ice cream. I'm fucking done.